Hey guys, we're gonna talk about diaphragmatic breathing today and why it's so important for exercise and then just daily life in general. So you have your diaphragm and your pelvic floor and those two work together to form what we call intra-abdominal pressure. And this pressure is what supports us through different types of activities, whether that be high intensity workouts, running, golfing, swimming, playing with your kids, whatever it may be. It's super important to know how to activate both of those with the breath. That way we can have our core really turned on when it needs to be and relaxed when it needs to be. So utilizing obliques, rectus abdominis, your transverse abdominis, which is the corset muscle of the core, and utilizing all of those into our breath to have a better breathing pattern that can be incorporated into our exercise. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that. First, you wanna lay on your back with your feet propped up. You want to bring the rib cage down and the pelvis up to where it's stacked on top of each other. So your back should be nice and flat into the ground. From here, you want to take a nice big breath in and exhale. Now take your hands and clasp them around the lower part of your ribs. You should feel a 360 degree expansion. So breathe into your fingers and exhale. On the exhale, you should feel your belly button going straight into the ground. So we're activating all our core muscles and the pelvic floor. So this is what it looks like here, 360 expansion. Exhale, bringing belly button to floor. So going back and forth allows the pelvic floor to contract and relax, same with the diaphragm, so that we can bring that into more of our daily activities. So try it out and let me know if you have any questions.